This is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 32 and verse 8. Bring it out. When the Most High divided to the nations their inheritance. The Lord divided all the nations and gave them a heritage and a culture. Read. When he separated the sons of Adam. And he separated the sons. The Lord is a separatist. Read. He set the bounds of the people according to the number of the children of Israel. And he set the bounds of the people according to the number of the children of Israel. So there's a difference between the Israelites and your Africans. I 100% agree. Now, I did between... Deuteronomy 20 and verse 15. Oh, so we can prove who the Israelites are. So, wait, what I, I guess what I'm getting at is how, 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 how do, if you're descendants of, how do you know you're not descendants of the Egyptians or the Israelites? What ties you directly to, to well, that? It, it first, no, you. You. It first, what, it first Timothy chapter 1. So, there's nothing in the Bible. There's first, nothing in the Bible. Verses. What's your name, buddy? The Rock. The rock. What ties the rock? There's nothing in the Bible that's going to tie the rock back. That's what I want to understand. Yes, what it is, is. I'm going to show you. What's that? Is it 2 Timothy or 1 Timothy? There is a picture of the, the About the endless uh, genealogies. 1 Timothy 1 and verse 6. I believe it's 2 First Timothy chapter one and verse four. Bring it out. Neither give heed to fables in endless genealogies, which minister questions rather than godly edifying, which is in faith, so do. Which is in what? Which, which is, is in, in faith, faith so, so do. do. Now get Romans 10, 17. According to my faith, I so heartily believe that I come from the, the children of Israel. Oh. I don't give heed to endless genealogies. I don't date back to who my great as of great grandfathers were. So you said a key word that I like there, faith. So Oh, this is how the Bible is about. Oh, faith. absolutely. Now, I, now read that. Romans 10 and 17. Bring it out. So that faith cometh by hearing. Faith cometh by hearing. In hearing by the word of God. So when I hear the word of God, when the Lord says that the children of Israel were going to slavery by ships, my faith should let me know that, wait a minute, they're my people. You see what I'm saying? Okay. That's, a, that's how I make that correlation. Okay, so faith, you got, you got it. So that's a that's an appropriate answer. So by faith, you're you're saying I'm now part of this uh, of this sect of of, of no, I am a part of that. Absolutely. Because the word of God is, so is can, can where you your continue, faith comes can you continue from. reading that same scripture. Continue reading that same scripture. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, absolutely. Tenth chapter? chapter seventeen. That's verse. Verse. Let's keep going. All right. Verse 18. But I say, have they not heard? Yes, verily their sound went into all the earth, and their words unto the ends of the world. But I say, did not Israel know? First, Moses said, I will provoke you to jealousy by them that are not a people. So like that are no people. And by a foolish nation, I will anger you. But Isaiah is very bold and said that I was found of them and that sought me not. I was made manifest unto them that asked not after me. But to Israel he said, all day long I have stretched forth my hands unto a disobedient and game saying people. Can you go back to, I think it was verse 18. I believe it was 18. Verse 18, Romans chapter 10 and 18. I believe so. Read it for me. It says, but I say, have ye not heard? Yes, verily their sound went unto all the earth, and their words unto the ends of the world. Also, right there. What? Someone, some, some. I'm sorry. Make your point. Yeah, I'm going to. So, so, what does that scripture mean right there? I, I believe, I believe what you what you mentioned, faith, is what I want to tie this whole thing to. You use faith to say that you're part of the Israelites, God. But what was the entire purpose? of what God was doing with Israel. What was the entire purpose of the Old Testament? To bring us to what? What you mean? So the whole purpose, and, and I believe yeah, it, I want you to make your point. Because you're asking me a question as if I should be answering an, answering it according to my feelings. I'm only going to go to the scripture and prove what I'm saying. Absolutely. I, I can use the scriptures as well to, to, to talk to us. I, I prove that faith only cometh by hearing the word of God. Absolutely. See what I'm saying? Absolutely. So whatever the Lord says is where I'm going to obtain my faith. 
Absolutely. And he's tying it back to the rest of the work. Absolutely. And I'm tying that same thing back. So what, 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 so what do you, what's the whole purpose of, what's the, if, do you believe in a heaven and a hell? Do you believe as the Israelites, do you believe that you have just a natural right because you, because you have faith as an Israelite, that you're going to have eternity with God? I, or what, what is, I what is, believe, what is I, the end of all, all of this that we're living in? I, I believe, believe, according to the say of the Lord, that the Israelites will be disconnected from their heritage and nationality. And in these last days, having the Lord prepare such a beautiful masterpiece, it would allow us to be brought back to our heritage and nationality. And we will remember who we are so that the elect could be sealed and we could return home and all nations would be a servitude to the Israelites. That's what the Bible teaches. Mm. Absolutely. I completely agree with that. Completely agree. So with the part that we're missing now, what are, what are, what are we missing? There's a part that we're missing that allows, so, so you're, you're Israelites. There are also Gentiles. So I'm, if, if, I, if I'm saying that I'm not an Israelite, do you believe that they're Gentile nations as well? Now you have to understand our sentiment. There are two different types of Gentiles. Okay. You, can we prove that? Oh, I, I, just go ahead. I, I, I believe you. Because I believe you with the word. What, I, what are the two I, I types of like Gentiles? I, I feel like I know where you're going with this. Now, if you study the scriptures, you you will understand that Israelites could be considered Gentiles. And you see it today. You know, you, we calling ourselves African Americans, and we idolize our life, our morality, based upon how these other nations conduct themselves. Get First Corinthians. Let me prove that. Get First Corinthians twelve and verse two. And a lot of our brothers like to teach that, and I'm pretty sure that's, this is where you're going with this. Na all nations can be saved according to what Paul was teaching and according to the sacrifice of Christ. Now, you have to understand that the Bible teaches that there are two different types of Gentiles. And the Gentiles Paul, Paul was teaching them and were referring to were Israelites, having been discontinued from the commonwealth of Christ. Read that. 1 Corinthians chapter 12 and verse 1. Bring it out. Now. Verse 2, ye know that you were Gentiles. Ye know that ye were, read that again. Ye know, know that ye were, were Gentiles. Gentiles. And what made us Gentiles? Carried away unto these dumb idols. Now it's impossible for a natural born Gentile to no longer be a Gentile. What made the Israelites Gentiles were idolatry in uh, the Hellenistical culture. You taking on the customs of other Gentile nations. So you're saying the church of that, that was that was first uh, first Corinthians. Corinthians. So, the, so that's the church of Corinth. The church of Corinth yeah. are Israelites. Right. So the church of Corinth, from the from that standpoint, had different 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 backgrounds of people because that was even why Paul de dealt with the it entire James, chapter from that standpoint. Ones. So I, I think where I think where where I'm trying to tie and go back to because I want to understand. I think there's a fundamental thing I want to understand where, where where we're at. And I heard you say it for the first time. You said Christ. What do you believe the purpose of Christ is for for Israelites and for for Israelites and for Gentiles? What is the purpose of Christ? Um, James one and one. Yeah, let me get a because that's a twofold question. Acts five thirty, and let me get John chapter eleven and verse forty nine. John eleven forty eight. Read read that though. James one and verse one. James 1 and verse 1. Bring it out. James, a servant of God and of the Lord Jesus Christ. James is, is, is writing a letter, right? Yeah. See what he says. To the 12 tribes. To the 12 tribes. Which are scattered abroad. Which are scattered abroad. What that mean? Hey, brother. You will have Israelites scattered abroad. It was already prophesied that you have Israelites in all nations. And it goes back to my more primitive, primitive point. When you, when, when, when you take a nation in captivity or having that the Israelites have to serve these other nations, it teaches them a lot of wickedness. And That's right. It discontinues it, it discontinue from your heritage and nationality. Now read, read, you got that? Go read that. It's the book of Acts, chapter 5 and verse 30. He, he asks us how we feel about Christ. The and God of our fathers. And what Christ came to do. Read that. The God of our fathers raised up Jesus, whom ye slew and hang on a tree. Right. Him have God exalted God, with the right. God has exalted Christ. Him have God exalted with his right hand. To be what? To be a prince and, and a, a savior. And a savior. For to give repentance 
to Israel. To everybody. To, to Israel. Israel. Now, and forgiveness of sin. Now that's Acts. That Peter saying that. Now read that. The book of John, chapter 11, verse number 48. Bring it out. If we let him thus alone, if we let him thus alone, all men will believe on him. Right. And the Romans shall come and take away both our place and nation. Now these are the Pharisees. They're coming together and they're trying to consult on how they're going to destroy Christ because they don't want these Romans, these Edomites, taking their land and their rulership and their authority. Now continue to read. That's the context. And one of them named Caiaphas. 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 So like Caiaphas, the high priest. Being the high priest that same year. Right. Said unto them, ye know nothing at all. Now he letting them know, y'all don't know, y'all don't know nothing. Y'all trying to kill this man. Evidently, y'all ain't been reading the Old Testament. Read. Nor consider that it is expedient for us that one man should die for the people and that the whole nation perish not. That the whole nation perish not. Absolutely. So you, you're dealing a lot with the Israelites. Got it. Hold on. Let me finish. I got 30 seconds let before finish. I got to go. That's I got 30. Cool. We, all, we, we here all, all night. Let me Wait, that's this. fine. I've been letting you talk let the whole time. Can, been, I finish, can I finish the word of God? I'm, I'm going to take you to the word can of God finish, as well. Can I finish the word go of ahead, God? Go ahead. Continue to read. So before he cut me off, Caiaphas said, it's expedient that Christ saves our nation. That's right. Read. And then spake he not of himself. But being high priest that year, he prophesied that Jesus should die for that nation. He prophesied that Jesus should die for that, that nation. He be letting them know Christ surely did come to die for us. For who? That's that what, nation. That Christ came to die for every single but individual. Read it again. So, so, so. Read and this again. Did, he did, not did, of himself, but back. being high priest, high priest that year, he prophesied that Jesus should die for that nation. All people. For that, that nation. nation. All nations. For, for that, that nation. nation. Read. And not for that nation only. Not for that nation only. But also he should gather together. Gather together. And one, the children of God that were scattered abroad. That were what? That, that were, were scattered, scattered abroad. abroad. I read that. So Zechariah chapter 7 and verse 14. Bring it out. Know, but... I scattered them with a whirlwind among all the nations. Among He scattered us among what? Among, among all, all the, the nations. nations. And Caiaphas being a high priest, I would, I would like to hope he knows something, said that Christ would gather those who were scattered abroad. So did Christ not come and did Paul and the apostles not come and, and create salvation to Gentile nations? Now, I just read Peter. No, I, no oh yeah. saying that Christ came in to be one, a savior. In, in one, in one verse, in one, in verse. one whole How verse. How many other chapters in Acts? Did, did yeah. I, I just? It's a simple question. It's a simple question. I, under one? I no, understand no, that you've done the work to go through in and Revelation connect a bunch two, of verses verse that are irrelevant six. to each other. And in I'm not. I'm not two, listening to this anymore. I'm sorry. Sure. Okay. I'm sure. I don't know. Okay. Let me get Revelation. Nah, because see, they hurt. So, so hurt. Because the truth, the truth hurts. Read that. Either set you free or kill you. Now I'm gonna get Christ. What you want, King? Revelation 2, the last book, Revelation 2, 2 26. No, I, I got, I, it's I, the I, book I, of Revelation. Brother, you got to separate from your enemies. So, so a couple different things. You got to separate from, uh, so listen, a couple, a, a listen we love things. you. You got to come back to your heritage, uh, man. A, a couple different things. So the one thing, the one thing where I, I think the primary disconnect that I think we could probably sit here all night and talk to it is that you're saying that Christ did not come and all die for all so I did was read the, so, all so, I did was read the yeah, Bible and I can basically go and read the same thing in Acts and show you where Gentile people where Paul when you Peter, have to understand Peter, who those Gentiles when, are when, when Peter literally said God why are you sending me to these people they are unclean they're Gentile nation and because God said, it so, won't it won't it won't ready for them to even come in contact with the Israelites that didn't know who they were so but did my, but my question is did God still die for those people did Christ? Yes, Christ. I, I, he by died the way, for the and, Israelites. And, and by yes. the way, and I'm a 100% believer that Jesus Christ is God. Oh, man. And, and this is where that disconnect get even further. <laughs> and per, that's Read perfect. That, man. No, that's perfect. This is the book fine, of man. Revelation, I, I, I it. chapter gotta, 2 gotta, and verse listen, 26. Gotta, I appreciate y'all's energy. And y'all's he energy. that overcome. Oh, this oh, red oh, love. We love you, brother. Come brother. on, brother. You got, listen, you got to 
separate from your enemy. We can teach you a lot. You, you yeah, seem yeah. you seem pretty I, powerful, but listen. So, so I'm, I, I am. I'm, I'm actually going to separate from my energy, right, my from enemies right now. All right. So y'all have a good night. All right. Y'all keep it going. Y'all keep it going. Read right? that. You can't your hate your brother. brother. He that overcome him and keep him my works word. unto the end. Him will I give power over the nations. What did Christ say? Him will, will I, I give power over, over the nations. nations. To do what with them? And he shall rule them with a rod of iron. As vessels of a potter shall they be broken to shiver. Damn, that's right. Even if, as I receive of my father. See, she cut, man. <laughs> when, when you slow walk these scriptures, they cut. See what I'm saying? You, you, can't, you can't get around it. Cannot get around it, man. Let me get uh get John chapter ten verse one. Get that. Was that that was an Edomite, right? Oh, oh, it, the it, lady. Yeah. Oh, yeah. She said, "I can't listen to this no more." <laughs> because she can't find salvation for her her people, man. <laughs> Read that, John ten. It's the book of John, chapter ten and verse one. Family, family, I say unto you. He that entereth not by the door into the sheepfold. What the Lord say? He, he that entereth not, not by the door, door of the sheepfold. See, because he trying to he trying to make a way for her to, to enter into some other way. They trying to sliver in this kingdom of heaven with some microwavable doctrine of how it could potentially potentially be plausible for all nations to be saved. Right? But what did Christ say? But climb up, up some other way. That's, and that's what they trying to do. Read. The same is a thief and a robber. What the Lord say? The, the same, same is a thief, thief and, and a, a robber. robber. See that? <laughs> Read on. But he that entered in by the door is the shepherd of the sheep. And this is the door. You know what I'm saying? Read oh. on. To him the porter opened them, and the sheep hear his voice. What the Lord say? And, and the, the sheep, sheep hear his voice. voice. See, he don't hear Christ, man. Brother called me an enemy. Wow. He don't love me. He put that Edomite over me any day. Cause I'm trying to get him this truth. He not trying to hear it. Thrust through. Hey, and I feel like he studied Israel, uh, Hebrew Israelites to even say, I'm a firm believer that Christ is God. Why that gotta be the last thing you say? You see what I'm saying? They like to insult our intelligence, like we don't study these scriptures. Yeah, he be watching that, uh, that vocab alone and... That shit is uh, crazy, uh, man. What's that, David Land? He probably be watching him hard. God. And he thought we ain't know nothing, man. He don't understand that. That's why he say the hour shot is God. And, they hate that, the most high. That's the last thing he, you know he wanted saying? to say before he left. I'm a firm believer that Christ is God. And I am separating myself from my enemies. That's <laughs> crazy. They don't love, our people don't love us, man. Oh, they hate us, man. Our, oh. people, love, our people hate us. That's oh. right. They hate us.